moon. A moon is an object in space. A moon is something that orbits another object in space, usually a planet. What does orbit mean? Orbit means... Goes. Our moon is called the moon and it goes around our planet Earth. Does it get dizzy? Don't think so, Marco. It takes 30 days for our moon to do one orbit. How did it get there? A large object, maybe another planet or maybe space material, bumped into the Earth. Watch out, Earth! Lots of pieces flew off, including one huge chunk, which scientists think formed our moon. So, the moon could be a big chunk of the Earth? Could be. Wow! Moon-tastic! Now, let's test your memory. Find a... Venus! Venus is a planet in our solar system, almost exactly the same size as our planet Earth. Which planet is that? That's Venus. It's the second planet from the sun in our solar system. If it's closer to the sun, it must be hot, right? It is, Willow. Great! I'm looking for somewhere hot to go on vacation. Somewhere with sandy beaches and crystal clear seas. Sorry, Willow. Venus is a rocky planet covered in volcanoes. Oh. It's way too hot for polos to survive. It's the hottest planet in our solar system. Why isn't Mercury hotter? It's closer to the sun. Venus is hotter because the gases on Venus hold in the heat. While you can't go to Venus, you can still see it from Earth. Venus is one of the brightest objects in the night sky. It looks like Venus is way too hot for a vacation. But I know a planet that's almost exactly the same size and just the right temperature. Which planet is that, Willow? Planet Earth! Where I can stare at Venus in the night sky. Now, let's test your memory. Milky Way. The Milky Way is one of the billions of galaxies in the universe. Willow, did you know that we live in the Milky Way? Huh? I thought we lived on Earth. We do, but our Earth is part of the Galaxy Way. So the Earth is part of our Sun's solar system and our sun is one of the stars in the Milky Way? Our sun is one of over 200 billion stars in the dusty, gassy Milky Way. 200 billion? This is what the Milky Way looks like. It looks flat! The Milky Way is called a spiral galaxy. It looks like a flat spinning pinwheel, doesn't it? <laughs> Scientists know that thousands of those stars have planets orbiting them, just as our planet Earth orbits our sun. So the Milky Way is full of billions of stars and us. Ha! Huh. We are all part of the biggest spinning pinwheel ever. Feeding time! Earth! This is planet Earth, the third planet from the sun. It's where we live. That's right, Marco. Luckily for us, 
Planet Earth has everything we need, like water, plants, and animals. The Earth is the only one of the eight planets in our solar system that has enough water and enough air for us to breathe. But why? All other planets are either too close to the sun. For example, Mercury is... Too hot? True. Or they are too far away. So Jupiter is... Too cold. And too gassy for life on Earth. So our planet Earth is in just the right place. Yes. It's the third planet orbiting our own star, the sun. <gasps> Air. And water. Thanks, planet Earth. Let's write Earth. H E A R T H Earth. <laughs> mm -hmm. <coughs> the milk. Mercury. Mercury, the closest planet to the sun. If you look at our solar system, you can see eight planets orbiting the sun. They look like spinning balls. They do, Chester. There's our Earth. Oh, yeah. And the planet near Mercury. Correct. It's the smallest of the planets. Chester. Do you know how many days there are in an Earth year? I do. About 365. Yes. That's the time it takes for the Earth to go round the Sun. Oh, Mercury goes round quicker. Well noticed. That's because its path around the Sun is much shorter. It only takes 88 Earth days for Mercury to orbit the Sun. Whoa! <laughs> I guess we should have a Mercury New Year's party every 88 days then. Party time! Now let's test your memory. Find the items that begin with... Mm. Mercury Titan Jupiter Mercury 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 Mercury, you found a match. 